So I've had a bit of a play with Panel Pro and what I'm trying to do is set up a, like a schematic panel of the of the layout showing the turnouts and the tracks and uh, so the best way to start that is go to panels, new panel, panel editor okay, and these first two uh, boxes at the top are just coordinates where you want each of the icons to come in but you just bring them in the zero zero and just drag them where you need it so I'm going to set the panel name as small layout and I've got a, a left hand turnout and a right hand turnout so I'll choose left hand turnout first Now the these are diagrams of what it will look like the actual icon, and you can change the icon. There's a library of, of different ones, but that's for another day. Now in the previous video, I uh, added in the switches, so the switches are here for me to select already. So the left hand turnout will be switch one, and I'll add the panel. I should just be able to drag that over. Now I need to add a right hand turnout. That'll be switch to, add the panel. It's the wrong way, so I'll just right click on that and uh, rotate 180 degrees. So there are two the left hand switch and the right hand switch. Now, if I just click on them with the mouse, you can hear in the background it actually throws the switches it's also shown in giving me an indication of whether they're thrown or closed so I'll close both of them now there are other icons here of, of signals and sensors and stuff I don't have any of that stuff yet you can add a background and I'm going to go right down the bottom to icon and just add this to the panel and add a couple more this is very rough at the moment this is roughly what my layout looks like so I have a straight bit of track at the back uh, one switch, another switch, and then three sec sections of straight track uh, going forward. Now, uh, I need to play around a little bit more of this and see if I can refine it a bit better. This is very simple at the moment, so I'll get back to it. Okay, so I found that if you you have your little icon here, or you turn out to right click and you can scale the percentage so I'm going to scale everything by 200% and that makes everything look a little better let's do this last one and there you have it so if I just click on the icon now yeah, it's still working can't quite work out where to save this panel yet but we'll have to go to instructions and check that one out so I'll get back to it okay so to save the panel in its raw state here you just go to your edit layer file save panel we'll call it small layout override it and uh, that's about it for this video.